I think coming from a background of higher education and knowing the importance of volunteer opportunities um, and getting into the community um, made me very excited to have a Binion Scholars. Um, we've had many different interns and this was an opportunity to adjust a little bit from an intern to an individual doing a project for us and um, couldn't have been happier with our placement. Arushi and I met on a very regular basis. Um, our first meeting was here at the lodge and I got to show her the space and really give her an opportunity to see the space but then decide what she wanted to do with the space and our guests here. Arushi did most of the work. Um, she had a lot of ideas and um, every time we met she would bring up the ideas and I would you know say well did you think about this or you know what about this and she had answers for everything and she had thought very well thought out um, everything that she wanted to do and yeah she made um, supervising her very easy. <laughs> her flexibility and willing to shift and adjust um, was amazing and and she just took it with a grain of salt and was like okay well let's let's be productive this way and we'll change it and you know and then she was so hopeful and I'm so glad that she stuck it out that um, she would get here eventually and it's been a few years in the making but it's here. I think other groups um, in the community should become a Benyon Scholar because why not? Um, having being able to share what we do here to someone that may be interested in this. Um, like, I want to shout about Hope Lodge from the rooftop, so why would I not share this with anyone that's interested in doing so? The advice I would give to groups working with Binion Scholars would be to just be very open-minded and flexible. Um, you never know what's going to happen. Um, and being able to really just watch your um, scholar flourish and be that support for them um, and let them just take this and run with it. Um, I couldn't have imagined a better um, outcome um, and we're going to be seeing it very shortly now that we are able to have volunteers back in the lodge that these guests are going to benefit from and I think that's the most important thing is really being able to you know, it's like I shared with Arushi that um, here's our need, here's what we wanted, and she just went with it. And so now this is a project that she's been so passionate about, and she's kept with it, and now she gets to see the outcomes of it. And so I just say, you know, just go with it, and you never know what's going to happen. I think the advice I'd give to students with working with community partners is to challenge us. Um, we're here every day, we see the same things. We may not see that there's a need, uh, um, and them coming in with fresh eyes, they may see that need, and they have this passion, and it's like, let that passion shine here. 